Alright, so this is the, uh, uh, Zack's manipulation scene. Uh, this is the scene where Zack manipulates all the pajanimals into dancing and becoming his slaves. Um, because Apollo said something that, uh, you know, Zack doesn't want them to hear. So, as you can see, I just hung a flashlight. That, that this should actually be dimmer. I also got a, a flashing blue light that's going on here. Um, yeah, this is so... Uh, I can... Hang on, I got a better idea. There we go. Alright, so the blue light is for creepy effect, but here goes. That scene probably took a total of uh, 10 minutes to make. Uh, and, you know, all my, uh, I had a friend over at the time. I was filming that scene and our moms were downstairs talking and everything. And there, you know, and then on the third floor where the Halloween store is, there's my friend on my computer playing games. And then there's me, dressed in uh, red, bloody makeup, uh, being a creepy puppeteer. And I still have to get used to telling people that this isn't actually what I do on a day-to-day -day basis. I'm actually going to place a seat here so I don't have to bend my legs. Uh, and here we go. There were three parts to that video, which is actually on my own personal channel. Uh, one part is where I'm rising up and uh, doing the thing. You know, the second part is this part where I'm actually manipulating the puppets and then playing with the cat puppet. The third part is where I'm just zooming in like I'm about to grab you. That's why I consider the... Uh, uh, this segment of the film to be the three-part segment of the Pajanimals horror movie. I'm actually going to go out and get another puppet to manipulate with. This is the part where the cat puppet comes in. Alright, so this is the cat puppet. Uh, yeah, and I'm going to manipulate. This will be used to... Like, in, this is a gimmick as to, like, manipulating the other, uh, uh, puppets. Here we go.
I am literally sitting in my bathroom on some sort of stool playing with a puppet with old Mayor Jenkins screaming in the background. This is what goes on in Infinity Studios. You're welcome, ladies and gentlemen. You're welcome. Now I'm going to do one final creep effect. Uh, now we're headed into the third part of Zachary's manipulation video, which is loosely based off of the first C of IT Chapter 2. Forget Dappy. Forget Jake the Reaper. And forget all the other monsters. That clip right there has to be the scariest I ever looked on public television. To the point where I could show that to possibly a 10 year old boy and he, uh, he'd start crying. Yeah.